And let me show you the seasoning that I've been putting on the chicken thighs. It is like delicious. Let me find it first. We only need the two of us together. I need only you in this crazy world. Cause we got love, love. I need only you here with me. You wanna get close to me? Why don't you do it right now? Good afternoon. Uh, so we went to go pick up Austin's um, cap and gown and tassel. It was very depressing. Um, I actually don't want to talk about it. We also went to BJ's and we went to Dunkin' Donuts and got uh, cold brews. And we went to BJ's to get eggs. So we got <laughs> Ten dozen eggs. Yes, I said. I know it seems like a lot, but we eat I a lot of three eggs. Three at a time. Yeah, she eats three a day. The dog has one in the morning with her food, one at night with her food, and then we make a lot of hard-boiled eggs as just like a go-to snack. So it really isn't a lot. And then sometimes we make recipes that obviously require freaking, you know, eggs. eggs. <laughs> so we got that we got the guinea pigs some kale we bought a couple of more uh, we bought some carrots um, got some more romaine lettuce that's for us and the guinea pigs and uh, bought this big thing here which I'm going to break apart right now mm. this is just a big thing of like chicken quarters we're gonna have chicken thighs tonight and let me show you the seasoning that I've been putting on the chicken thighs. It is like delicious. Let me find it first. Um, oh, here it is. So this is what I've been putting on our chicken and just this. I don't put anything else. This is the Kinder's Buttery Steakhouse. It is really good. We found it at, I want to say BG's. Could have been Costco, but one of those two. And it is really delicious. So yeah, we'll be having that tonight. Austin's having the roasted veggies like he had last night, but he, I'm making him a nice steak with it. So I've got a steak that is just thawing out for him for later. Um, Arlo has a pork rind addiction. We got that from Amazon because we can't find pork rinds for some reason in our area. Usually the, it's pretty easy to find, but I don't know. Long. Along with the toilet paper, I guess pork rinds was a hot Come on. commodity. Uh, yeah, so that's, that's what we're doing right now. Arlo is, I'm not sure what she's doing. She's got like weird shit out. I don't think I will be pork rinding it with you today. That's it's more your jam today. I am going to have a couple of hard boiled eggs. I'm probably going to have a cheese stick. I might have my, uh, no, I'm, I think I'm going to eat my Trader Joe's truffle cheese. I got a piece left. So I'll have that with maybe a piece or two of salami and oh. hard boiled egg. That's it. That'll be lunch because it's late. Anyway, that's all, folks. There's really nothing happening. The sun is out. I know it's a weird, but the sun is out. It's just very windy today, and it's kind of chilly. So anyway, I'll cut up those chicken quarters after I have my lunch. Oh, well, Arlo's going to do it. And uh, that's all. That's what's happening. Not much. All right. I'm just going to give you a quick overlook of what we're what lunch looks like for us today obviously we have our cold brews from dd uh no you don't have to cut it i'm just gonna i'm just gonna eat it like that so i have this tiny little How piece many pieces of do you want? um i think three is a serving right yes yeah give me three so i got a tiny little piece of truffle cheese here and then this here is um the pub cheese that is this I'm sure you guys have seen this before. This is the sharp cheddar pub cheese. We've had various uh, variations of this pub cheese. I don't know if we've had just regular sharp cheddar. Uh, we've had a bacon one. I wasn't a fan. But, so, two tablespoons of that. Three pieces of salami. Two hard-boiled eggs. We've got a couple of pork rinds that we... Um, how come yours looks so pretty? You want some tomatoes? No, I'm, I'm good. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just talking about that prettiness right there. You can't wrap my eggs or something with the salami. I'm just kidding. Let's no, no, try. no. Let's no, try. no, no. Let's try. 
No. No! You haven't washed your hands yet since you've been home. Yes, I have, because I peed. Lying ass bitch. Anyway, oh, the camera's about to die. Holy shit. So, yeah, this is, this is what lunch looks like for us today. In case you're curious, keto at its finest. Look who remembered to show you dinner! Anyway, chicken thighs. Here are the peppers that I made with pimento cheese and wrapped in a half a slice of bacon a piece. I've got a watermelon LaCroix, a little bit of grape tomatoes and um, Persian cucumber. I'm going to add a little bit of this creamy Caesar to that, some salt, whoops, salt and pepper. And then I'm probably going to have an avocado with it. And yeah, that is dinner tonight. Are you excited? I am. Look, we even have like, there's like this ambiance, ambiance about dinner tonight. Do you want me to uh, light a candle? Uh, no. Tina is a very bad vlogger because she did not show you what I wanted to play around with. So one of our friends had sent us um, some cereal to try. They look like Frosted Flakes. Wow, Frosted Frakes. Welcome back, Arlo. Frosted Flakes by a company called Heike. By itself, Did you say Frosted Flakes, Rice Krispies? Shit. Rice Krispies. Oh, wow. Oh, I have no idea. Well, Dana wanted to throw them away, and I didn't want to. Why? Because I save everything. Don't we know that already? Anyway, we wanted some kind of a dessert, so this is what I came up with. This is what I came up with. They're kind of like um, a Nestle Crunch. Can we see? No. Okay, anyway, it's like a Nestle Crunch with peanuts. Dana had a piece earlier and she tried it and she said it tasted really good. Oh my god, I can't wait to have another piece. So I showered. My hair is no longer straight, <laughs> as you can tell. And uh, we've got to get up early tomorrow. Well, Rico has an 11 o'clock appointment at the vet for his shots and all that stuff. So we have to get up. We're bringing Chloe with us because God forbid we leave her by herself and take him. She, she will flip out. So we'll be doing that tomorrow. So we're going to go to bed a little earlier than what we normally do. And um, I mean, that's pretty much it. We, walk, we walked almost three miles again tonight. So that was nice. It, we froze our ass, so that wasn't nice. Mm. And, uh, you know, we'll see you guys in the morning. So, toodles. Goodbye. Okay, so as much as I wanted to vlog when we were out, it was, an impo it was not possible because we had to take both dogs. One went to the vet. We couldn't even, we were literally eating hair in the car because the hair just goes... Flies everywhere. Yeah, it goes everywhere. It's so, ugh. And then, so then I stopped and got some Starbucks at the store on our way back because we needed a Starbucks for that ordeal. But he's good now. He's fine. He looks good. He's had his shots. He got his heartworm testing, heartworm pill, uh, flea and tick med, and all of that stuff. So he doesn't go back till next year, which is good. Um, so now we're going to have some breakfast. I'm actually going to make some tuna. And I'm going to make it on, I'll show you these crepinis. I don't know if I showed them to you or not. I think I might have, but I'll show you again. These crepini cauliflower, I call them butt wraps because they kind of smell like butt. But they're a great vehicle when you want to have like a wrap. And there's pretty much nothing in them. So I'll show you what those look like once I get going. Anyway, good afternoon. Hi. Peoples. Hola. I don't know the last time uh, we spoke with you, but what? I'm talking to the peeps. the peeps. The peeps, you know, them behind the screen. Anyway, um, you would think she'd be used to me talking to myself by now, but I guess not. Uh, we took Rico to the vet. Weezy had to be in the car with us because she's a jealous bitch. 
Apparently Rico uh, expressed himself in the uh, in the uh, vet's office, so. Uh, we had to mow the lawn, um, so we did some yard work, and now we're having dinner. Uh, Dana's been wanting a burger bowl. I've I've been trying to hold off on it because sometimes you know you want something other than a burger, but we have it tonight. And looking at it, I'm very excited. Let me show you. So, ah, that took forever. Uh, burger, cheese, bacon, crispy, just the way I like it. Just some romaine, tomato. We have some uh, green beans and onions. Sauteed mushrooms, that's just some ketchup and mayo. And then, of course, sugar-free ketchup. Yes, sugar-free ketchup and regular I mayo. that's it. Food. I'm having an avocado with mine. Avocado with mine and pickles. Oh. That, that's pretty much it. Yep. That's the only difference. Dana's got a seltzer water over there. Mine's right here. And then probably going to have some of that too. It's my water. We were very busy today. Whoops. Sorry. Very busy today. Very. So I'm making coffee. Whoa, you don't need to be that close. So I just showered. My hair is wet. So it's kind of looking a little... This quarantine hair is really killing me here. Um, I'm making some coffee right now. I'm watching the fries. I don't know if I've told you about this, but when Arlo was sick with COVID, I found this amazing couple on YouTube called The Fry Life. Um, it's Mary and Peter Fry, their dog Oliver, which is her service dog, and then their cat, their hairless cat, Harry. And I absolutely adore them and their family. They got me through some really rough times with um, Arlo being sick. It was, it was a really rough month. And watching them every day, number one, put a smile on my face. Number two, it just, it just made me not think about what was happening. And that was a blessing. I'm telling you right now, that was a blessing in disguise. So, Arlo's in the shower. I am gonna make up my coffee, put my cream and stuff in it. And um, the kids are, I don't know, doing something. Smith is on the phone with her girlfriend. And Austin is gaming, go figure. But we will see you tomorrow morning. Um, we're either gonna watch this movie, Dangerous Lies, that we've been trying to watch for two days now on Netflix, or there is a new series on there called Sweet Magnolias. So, it's going to be one of those two. We'll see what happens. Arlo hasn't really been into, like, binge-watching things lately. I'm not sure why I like it, but I'm not going to force her. So, maybe we'll watch Dangerous Lies. That is a movie. So, we'll see what happens. And Chloe is there, if you can see her. She's on my bed. Anywho, so we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Uh, we're just going to be hanging around the house tomorrow. We don't have anything to do, thank goodness. And um, it's supposed to be like in the 60s, so maybe we'll sit out on the porch in the back, get some sun, have good food as usual, just chillax. Because Arlo has a doctor's appointment on Friday. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Toodles. Good morning. Happy Thursday. It is... The 21st of May, just in case. I'm kind of putting that there as a reference as well because when I do edit these vlogs, I need to know what day it is. So, today is the 21st of May. Happy 21st of May. Um, we had our coffee already. We just were chilling in bed for like the last maybe hour and a half or so. And just hanging out. I mean, really, what's why I get up? What's the point of getting up early? What, what's happening? Nothing. So it's now, I believe, a little after 11. It's 11, it's 11, 11, make a wish. I'm um, gonna have egg roll in a bowl for uh, brunch today. Probably gonna have that with 
I'm um, probably going to have that with an avocado. No, I'll have my avocado tonight because we're having another burger bowl because it was so good last night. Exactly what we showed you yesterday is what we're having today for dinner. So, I think I'm just going to have the egg roll in a bowl. So, I'll have that for lunch. I'm not sure what Arlo's having. She's probably going to do like eggs, so that's fine. Uh, we're going to sit outside, enjoy this beautiful sunshine that we're getting. It's a little chilly out. I'm hoping it warms up just a little bit more so we can sit outside. I mean, either way, we're going to sit outside. And then later on, we're going to wash her car, probably take a walk. And that's it. That's, I mean, we're, we're in quarantine. What else is there to do? Nothing. So, this is kind of like the extent of the day. This is, this is what happens when you're in quarantine. Anywho, happy Thursday. We had lunch. I added two tablespoons to this. Carlos vlogging and I'm Instagram storying. I added two tablespoons of heavy whipping cream and it's absolutely perfect. And I measured that bitch out because ain't nobody trying to drink a 500 calorie coffee. Whatever she said. Um, did we show them what we had for lunch? We had a smorgasbord. I was supposed to show them the egg roll in a bowl, but I mean, they've seen the egg roll and I just put it in a bowl. So it really wasn't anything different than what they've seen. You know? She had egg roll in a bowl. I had I some scrambled eggs. Egg, egg I had plate. some of the uh, tuna that she made and then some leftover wings from like a couple days ago. You had um, the weirdest lunch I really ever. did, but you know what? It was like leftovers and why the fuck not? I wish you could see what nope, the hell was just happening right now. Because I am underwearless, so I'm only fine. I'm not, I'm not. She was dancing like, you know, you know the song? Dun, 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 dun. Look at that. It's her ice espresso. Mmm, with the metal straw. Yes, Can please. you say it? Can you hear it? Can you hear How it? How fucking annoying. Anyway, I'm going to show you. Kind of what she did. So, here goes. So that was our um, ice espresso. Yes, it's a regular old jar that I haven't taken off the uh, labels for, but we're gonna go out and enjoy the song. We're actually gonna bake the leather handbags. Hopefully sometime soon. I don't know yet. See you later. <laughs>